What's up guys? Welcome back to our YouTube channel and for today we are going to be answering questions that couples are too afraid to answer. Yeah so we did a video in the past like this so this will be the part two maybe even juicier and better I guess we'll find out with the questions you guys asked on our Instagrams make sure you guys are following our Instagrams if you aren't already we'll leave them right here also go check out our Vegas pictures together yes and yeah you can follow my Instagram don't worry about Jenna's bruh Oh, I post more than him, so you should probably follow him. Whoa, really? Low blow, no? Shots fired. Okay, but anyways, before we get this video started, guys, please don't forget to leave a like because it really helps the video out, and we appreciate it. Let's get right into the video. Who's going to ask? You go first. You go first. Okay, I haven't even taken a look at the questions that you guys asked, so I'm kind of scared. I don't know how juicy I'm willing to get here, but I guess we'll see. Some juicy questions. We'll start off strong. Oh, boy. All right, let's go. The first question, so just stay tuned, you guys, because it's probably going to escalate from here. Sex before marriage, question mark. That's the question. To be or not to be is the real question here. What's your answer? I don't even know what the question's implying. Like, yes. Have we? Is that the question? Or is it just like your thoughts on thoughts. it? Thoughts. Thoughts on it? Honestly, if I didn't meet you so young and we weren't together for so uber long, I probably- Oh, pause, pause. Uber didn't go- right there it's a word uber no but long. it didn't fit okay well fifth in my mind i probably would have wanted to wait well that would have been really really wrong i like the concept of waiting till you like the concept but it didn't work it didn't work no all right this one not so juicy but just a personal question how many kids do you want two or three like seven <laughs> we need a whole no. basketball team ten ten five on the court five on the bench I'm serious. We no. need a t-ball team, football. Four is like so my top. We'll do five. I'm not doing five. See, like, yeah. how are we going to get to the NBA? How? how do we know we're going to have athletic kids? Because <laughs> we'll work on it. There you go. When will Will propose? Oh, my God. So the reason I want to do this video. <laughs> yes. Oh, my God. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Like one. The world may never know. We haven't done a sit down video in a while. This is fun. You guys are like 2004, right? Or five? No. I'm 2003. Boy. Is that your question? 2002. Boy. All right, this one's just for you. Not, not too bad. Not too bad. Why do girls expect the guy to make the first move? Why? Why? I wanted you to make the first move because I just wanted it to be you. But huh? I, I don't think girls expect guys to make the first move. I think some girls make the first move. You think? Yeah, for sure. I don't think it's always the guy. No. But I would do say, girls expect the guy? Um, uh, maybe. I, I would say, I don't know. I don't know. I've been in a relationship for four years. I don't even know. I don't even know how to flirt. <laughs> I'm so stuck at you. <laughs> oh, okay. Do y'all ever fake being happy around each other? No. Why? Because if we're just not happy, we won't be happy. We are not afraid to show if we're not happy. And the thing that I also like about us is if we're not happy and we have anything to do for social media, we just don't do it. No matter how important, we just don't do it because we like our content to be very genuine. So if we're not in the mood and we're like fighting or we're not happy with each other or we're not happy in general, we just don't do it. Yeah, you could probably tell. Yeah. Like right now, I'm faking it. Yeah, like right now, we just had an argument and we still haven't finished it yet. So whatever. But on to the next question. When is a good time to do the deed? It's all about preference. All about preference. Like what? Like whenever you feel comfortable with the person and you feel ready. Once you know that this person is somebody that you really like want to be with and you're comfortable around them and you're ready, then that's the time. I feel like you just feel when it's the right time. Don't force it. No, don't force it. Forcing it, especially if you force yourself to do it, you might regret it. Yeah. So don't, don't, yeah. don't force it. It's not worth it. You could always regret it, but like you'll never regret not doing it. Just wait until you really know you're ready. God. <sighs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This might be too deep. Oh, God. I think I, I probably saw this question already. What is it? Favorite sex position. I knew it was that one. I I really don't. It, I feel like, it for me, it doesn't, I, I, all of them. <laughs> we always do this one, but we have to do it because it's been a while. Name one ick you have of each other. Oh, my God. I love your guys' videos, by the way. I have so many. Thank you. Oh yeah, thank you. We love you. And um, we're at the stage- Let's start fighting right now. We're at the stage where we've been dating so long that we fight like siblings, so everything he does pisses me off. No, you know what pisses me off the most? You in the morning. I, I have said this so many times. I'm getting into bed now. Call him 30 minutes later and he goes, decline, decline, because you're still in bed. Like, I know you're still in bed if you're gonna decline. You might as well just answer. 
What's my ick about you? You, you complain about everything. I do com- What? Wait, what? You just farted! No, it was my shoe it's... on the- Oh. <laughs> I do complain about everything. It's yeah. my least favorite quality tree by myself. Oh, shit. I'm very negative. Aww. And you wanna know why? Because my dad is negative. Yeah. He's negative in aspects of being smart about things. I'm negative in aspects of just complaining about everything. So I don't get it from him. I just am a negative person. But I wanna work on that. I get the whole because your dad, my parents, like you're 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 your parents, but at the same time you're your own person. Dude, I can't help it. I need to work. But you and your dad are exactly the same. I feel like yeah, but it's okay because it makes me more wise, I think. Okay, next question. This one's not so juicy, but it's what do you argue about most? I mean, we're in the same realm. What do you mean? Of like the last question. We are? A little bit. We have two different personality traits that make it really hard, but we make each other better, which is a good thing, but sometimes it causes arguments. Yeah. What would you say our biggest arguments are normally about, though? I feel like we haven't really argued recently lately. Yeah. Right? We like, just bicker. Yeah, we have, like, little things. Like, Jen just gives a lot of attitude sometimes. You give me reason to give attitude sometimes. Oh, what's the reason? You're unreliable. The hell? Like, really? You're just like a young boy, I think. I always say this. Jenna grew up too fast. <laughs> just because I'm reliable. That, that, that <laughs> makes no sense. I could be the most reliable person. I'm responsible, so I grew up too fast. How are you reliable? Tell me. I'm always, like, doing things that need to be done. I'm always That's up. not reliable. I'm, I never really miss. Like, this has answer. nothing to do okay. with being reliable. Okay. <laughs> I don't think you know what being reliable is. I <laughs> just... Yes, it... Done. <laughs> If you call me and you need me to come over, who do I go? If I call you and I say be over at 8 o'clock. I asked a question. That, oh, sure, that's like 10% of it. But if I call you and I say be over at 8 o'clock tomorrow, I know you're not going to be over at 8 o'clock tomorrow. That's being unreliable. I'll be there at like 820. <laughs> I'm still there. Yeah, I, but like if you need actually needed something done, like I'm, yeah. I get it done. <laughs> All right, whatever. Next question. What are we most proud about in our relationship? I feel like we've kind of talked about this before. What? I would say it's our loyalness. Yeah, that's a good one. We're very loyal. Loyal. <laughs> Do you sleep with each other? I don't know if this means like sleep. Wait. Or if it means sleep. We do, yeah. We do. But, we have um, sleepovers all the time. No, we actually don't. Recently. Recently, we've been having sleepovers, but... We went, like, a whole, like, year with having, like, barely any sleepovers. Yeah. But we just started having, like, three sleepovers in a row. But I like not having sleepovers. Why? Sorry. They don't need to be so specific. Sorry. <laughs> three sleepovers in a row. Like, nobody cares. Like, what are we, two years old? But can I just say that I like not having sleepovers because if we were ever to grow up and eventually move in together within, like, whatever amount of time, it makes it more meaningful. Because if we do end up moving in together and living with each other, we're going to be sleeping together. Exactly. So. And it'll be, like, a nice, like, thing to... No rush. Yeah. How do y'all resolve conflict, come to an agreement, go through confrontation? Okay. Can I just say that I'm better at this than you are? No. No, we're not. <laughs> okay, no. She's so stubborn that it's hard for her to come to no, an agreement. No, recently? I... Recently. This is what I say. Don't... Tell me I say this. I always say it's not worth it. The oh. argument isn't worth it. When we have arguments... I would say recently you've been more stubborn. I think I'm very good at teaming up as a team to go against the problem rather than be battling. You like to battle, I would say. I like to say, okay, yes, I did this wrong, but so did you, so let's fix it. You're like, do, 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 do. <laughs> what the fuck? I think I'm better at that, but I'm also very, very stubborn. I guess it depends on the day. Yeah, you're, you do. You do a good job. But I tell do. me, do I not say, like, most of the time I'm like, it does not matter? It doesn't matter, but the thing that's really bad about that is it matters to me. And you're giving up on the conversation. Me, what I do, it's finding a resolution. You just give up, and it's annoying. No, I'm not giving up. I'm just trying to point out that what we're doing, it's not worth, worth it. fighting. You think what you're doing is good, but really it's not. I don't do it every time. It makes it feel like you're just giving up and you just want to stop arguing, which I get. But at the same time, we have to fix it and make each other feel valid and find a solution. I agree. You don't even listen to anything I say. You said we should find the solution. <laughs> What's the ratio of how much time you spend together to how much time you spend apart? Great question. We're together 65-35. I was going to say 60-40. I would even say 50-50. Nah. 
Think about how much time of the day that we're not together. We yeah. see each other for like the night. All right, 60 40 is good. Yeah, I would say 60. We're together a little more than we're apart. Once again, if we ever live together, we're going to be with each other a lot. Yeah, and I don't really think that we're that ready for that. Like, not not ready. Whoa. Like, no, no. Like, I'm going to go. I Listen, didn't know. This video is showing a lot about us. I, I get it. I get it. I really do. I didn't mean ready. I meant like I we're a taxi. not. I meant... What did you mean? I meant I'm not like... We've never done it, so it'd be like a new thing. Do you really like me? Um... Why is it taking so long? <laughs> Depends on the day. <gasps> Alright, last question. No! <laughs> Three more. Oh my god. Three more. Look, don't leave my light on. Will just left his light on in his car yesterday and his car died and my dad and his dad had to come there and jumpstart his car. Do not leave my car light on. Okay, <laughs> next question. Do you guys ever fight about politics? <laughs> what the hell? I didn't know what question to ask. No. <laughs> No, we're not big politic people. I don't really know much about politics, so we can't even fight about politics. People are gonna be mad at us for not being politic people. No, they're not. No, we're not not politic people. We're just not that knowledgeable to be politic people. Yeah, so I don't talk about it. We try to learn, but we can't be politicians. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> politicians. Oh my god. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> Do couples watch porn? Did I say that word? Pawn. <laughs> I don't. No. You don't? Yes, couples. you do. They're asking if couples watch so porn. So you do. You know girlfriends don't let their boyfriends watch porn? Did you know that? Who? I see TikToks about it all the time. It's asking do couples watch porn? Not, not Maybe not individually, but like no, some- No, we some, don't watch porn Some together. also watch it together. What? I think that's a thing. No. But <laughs> answer's no. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Do you want to do that? No. <laughs> it seems like you wanted to. But I, that's what I thought the question was. Oh. I wasn't talking about individually. Okay, well, I didn't know what the question meant. Sorry. Just starting a conversation. Sorry. It's like a little podcast. He hates what I see. It's whatever. We're arguing because I talk too much. Yeah. This is YouTube, Wait, you know? why? Did I say this too much? This is YouTube, Why you know? did I say that was too much? It's just, like, too personal. You don't want them knowing you watch porn? Oh my god, no. Just scratch that whole fucking section. Do you fart in each other's mouths? Okay, Okay. now we're done. Now we're done. That's so weird. Who asked that? No. Alright. <laughs> Tim's getting a little... No, I was joking! You make me sound so weird! Oh my she god. does this a lot. I was literally just joking. I was trying to make a joke. You make me look weird. I was literally just joking around. It's weird. They when... know it's a joke. Okay, we're done. Okay, you guys, we hope this video was somewhat good. I don't know. I feel like it was a little chaotic and everywhere, but if you guys liked it, please leave a like and let us know if you guys want to see another one of these videos. These are fun. Yes. Guys, please watch our last video, our Vegas vlog. Please watch it. It took us a lot of time. It was, it was fun and it's actually like entertaining. A funny video. Yeah, there's some drinking. Will's first drinks. Yeah. <laughs> first drinks. Thank you guys so much for watching. You already said that, you already said that. I know, but that's our outro. Oh, okay, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, and... We'll catch you guys next week. Peace! I feel like I was way too energetic in that video. You were just what happened? off the fucking wall. I was going to drink an energy drink, too. Thank God. What? I was. Oh, my God. Chipotle. Ah! <laughs>